<clears throat> Tower of Stress. Tower of Stress by Mr. Rocks. Here we are in Tower of Stress. It's very stressful. Hold on. Forgot the keyboard overlay. Starting off here, we have multiple parts already, and hmm, normally I go this way, but I'm gonna try to be a bit different, you know? See how that goes for me. Uh, we're taking the normal path, which is a little longer, but it's also actually possible, apparently. Yeah, first floor done. Uh, very good. Well, this song used to be different, I'm pretty sure. Now, straight away, look at this. We have a lot of different paths we can take. Clearly, the easiest one is all the way up here. Wait, I, <laughs> I didn't mean to actually do- T-pose. Okay. What happens when I T-pose? Does- uh, do I blow up? I feel like that's what's supposed to happen. And look at this extremely necessary wall hop skip I can do. Look at that. I am so- Floor 3 already. Nice. I'm gonna try experiment. Some people don't like the timer for some reason. So, dude, check out these sick tricks. Oh, 360, 360, 360. Oh. People also know Hat Rocks for, um, what other towers does Hat Rocks have? Oh, this jump. Make sure you align it very carefully as it's extremely far. You do some advanced strats to, I wonder if I'm gonna get any copyright claims. I hope not. Fun fact about this tower's music, it's the default music for the kit. I don't know, what do you think about the frame colors? Cause I kind of like them actually. Like it's not a gradient, but you know, gradient frames are getting old. Well, this, this tower was probably made before any gradient frame, but you, you get what I'm trying to say. Like in newer area, well, actually there's a whole other discussion because you, you can see where they're coming from with the rule against... Well, I don't know if you know, but there was like a... What? You have to go on this side instead. I oh, know, it's very hard to understand. Okay, this jump, you want to stand from the highest point to do it. And for this jump, it's very important to climb down here and align yourself at exactly 3000 degrees Celsius and then do that to skip this because I said so. So I know people are going to say that, oh, is this a voice reveal? Oh my gosh, voice reveal. Uh, no, it's not. I've used my voice in quite a few videos and streams as well. I don't use them for my normal guides because they're text commentary. I thought that would be obvious. So they also contributed to Tower of Peaceful Happiness and Tranquility, which is the second easiest tower in Ring 2. No, what? Say the best way to go about approaching this is to... Now, I know this very scary looking kill Rick Spinner, so a very beginner way of doing this is by coming this way and then keep going. Yeah, listen to the royalty free music flow through your veins. Oh, ho, ho. Kind of missed towers where each floor was like 10 seconds long. Well, I guess not really, it's just, what is this? Probably the most famous floor, second most famous, maybe. Maybe it's just me who finds this floor super memorable. Now one, it has heaps of skips, and two, it's very stressful. It's mainly because of these jumps, because they're long, apparently. Not that long. Yeah, but like for 2020, in 2020, when I first beat this tower, these jumps were very scary. Even though I don't think I ever failed them. Mm. 
Why did I do that? Question I'm often asked is, am I an AI? And my answer to that is, thank you, but no. We're on floor 25 at the moment and things are looking up. What is your opinion on the current state of Duke's Towers of Hell's economy? And to that, I answer, I have, I have that many tickets because I do the weekly challenges still. Okay, 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 okay. And we're back at floor one. Well, you know what they say. If at first you don't succeed, just give up. Very clearly giving up. No, I'm not. I wonder if you can come this way. <laughs> I kind of only just noticed how different, like, the floor colours are from the actual obstacle colours. Like, you see how it's pink and... Uh, uh. Forgotten Ridge. That was cool. How did I do that? Hold on. Hold on. I should be commentating on Tower of Void, so I should do that. That was an X pusher, you just do stuff. These spinners carry you, which is actually extremely helpful, because if they didn't carry you, I'd be falling off them all the time. All right, we have reached the most famous part of the tower, which is the Leap of Faith. All right, so I'm actually gonna try a new strat. I think first you ledge grab, then the line. Shift back up, then, and now you get the long climb up. It's pretty fun, actually. It's not even a speed booster or anything, you just climb up. Kind of looks like a roller coaster track if you're looking up like this. And then, after not that long, you finally reach the top, and then you can welcome to the last two floors. Hope you've had fun so far because I have, and uh, I have, I have. These are falling platforms, so you need to jump off them pretty soon. They don't fall anymore now. Dun, 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 dun. Look at all those skips. Look at all those cool bricks. Hey, that rhymes kind of. I should be a um, politician. The trust jump once again. I love this trust jump. It's actually... There should be a sequel to this tower called Tower of Nervousness where instead of there being a giant floor nine truss leap of faith there's you have to do your taxes so you like you can't jump there so you just go down you go up this jumps actually kind of hard oh uh, jumped there yeah look at that it's the final floor we're going to win now there's a very very faint path here do you walk along instead here's a very very crucial speed run the strat for those who don't like doing one stud wraps see just like that these wraps are pretty easy, and I like the clouds. All right, let's win now. And here we have the wind pad. We are on the final floor of Tower of True Skill. This time for real, because I didn't skip any checkpoints. I even got the checkpoint that is located inside the island <laughs> winning for real this time no checkpoint skipped nice and easy dip player I uh, I don't care look behind you when you are done touch the green if you want to see more videos like this uh too bad but otherwise Thanks for watching and I'll see you soon for, um, bye. That killed me way too soon. I was expecting to fall longer.